Hi, welcome to Stonegate Glass Studio and Gallery. It's the 26th of February 2013 and here's just the most up-to-date uh, scan around the gallery to show you what we currently have in stock uh, in case there's anything you might be interested in popping down to have a look at. Um, for you that haven't been to look at the gallery before, I'll just give a quick overview of some of our work we have uh, in the portfolio. Here it shows examples of our previous stained glass work, splashbacks, um, a lot of our commissions which are also available on the website for you to look at in more detail. I'm just going to flick through those quickly now. Uh, coming around here uh, it, we can see our counter with a lot of the jewellery in. We have various jewellery, silver, glass, aluminium uh, and here amazingly we still have some Christmas decorations. They do sell incredibly well all the year round, so for the first time this year we've kind of left them out into February um, because people are still interested. Just showing you some of our tea light holders there made here in the gallery. A little bit more of the jewellery and just to try and give you a bit of a feel about what goes on here in the workshop and in the office. You can see through to our kilns there in the, uh, the glass area. Okay, so we do a lot of glass here. Um, this is one of our mirrors with fused glass attached. And you can see down here um, one of our artworks and a few other bits being prepared to go out to various customers. Um, we've got some of our paintings by Terry Hurd, local artist. Um, some bowls here, some glass bowls by Loco Glass. These are just very new in. Uh, a clock here. By stone splitter pottery and a horse by Karen Lainson in ceramic. And then going down here to some lovely wooden stools by Olive Designs. I can't really spend too long on each individual item, so I'm just going to kind of whiz around a Tim Atkinson mirror there, some more of our fused glass artworks. We have a selection of our own artworks on display but really anything is possible and people often come in with specific sizes and colour schemes and design ideas and we work them up some drawings to make them exactly what they require. There's a few more Terry Heard paintings. Going down now to some Jackie Atkins ceramics, some, some of our tea light holders and bowls, a few more bits there. We've got a good selection of, of jewellery. Show you quickly through the cabinet. Glass discs there. Some nice perfume bottles by Bob Crooks. This video is really just to try and give you a, a quick idea of what's available in stock at this particular date. We don't always have time to keep the, uh, the shop site updated on the website. And as work is always going out, it's useful for people to see exactly what we have in on any given day. Some uh, freshwater pearl jewellery there by Julia Foggin. Some more metal jewellery there and some fused glass jewellery there by uh, Kina Timner from Sweden. Here we'll run along this cabinet here, see some glass by Loco Glass. One of our glass waves and tea lights. A bowl and an oil drizzler there by Stuart Ackroyd. Coming up to some more of our artworks now. There's an embroidery there by Joe Hill. And some ceramic plaques by Jackie Atkin. She makes uh, a lot of ceramic vessels but she's also recently started doing these plaques which are proving very popular. Another local scene there by Terry Hurd and another one of our artworks. Another gorgeous clock there by Stone Splitter Pottery. And a large cowrie bowl by Loco Glass along with more Jackie Atkins ceramics. Going up now to a Janine Partington enamel. One of our mirrors, which again obviously can be made in any size or colour scheme that you require. Some more of our smaller artworks framed up. Coming down. 
So some more glass by Loco Glass, another Jackie Atkins vase and a Christine Cummings sleeping pig. And coming into the window we've got yet more Jackie Atkins plaques and some scent bottles by uh, Stuart Ackroyd Glass. And a lovely big blanket chest here by Matt Jardine cabinet makers. Going to the other shelves, we've got some of our sort of spring range, we've got some, for some nice spring light fresh colours which are nice at this time of year, some more loco glass scent bottles, one of our little waves and more Stuart Ackroyd scent bottles there. Some Alan Fichot part porcelain vases there from France. One of our larger artwork pieces. And some great curved Stuart Ackroyd perfume bottles. One of our baby waves, which is something we offer, which is a, a, to take the impressions, the imprints of children's hands and feet and emboss them into glass with the engraved details of the special occasion. Some really fresh and vibrant uh, loco glass vases, which are new in. Some uh, Jackie Atkins a vase and a sly glass vase there, and a Fiona Klukas painting. I'm just going to whiz around this selection here. Some another stone splitter clock, various sly glass perfume bottles, and Stuart Ackroyd perfume bottles. Coming down here onto the blue shelf with the more scent bottles, candle holders and a large wave. This is kind of really just to give you an idea of, of uh, what you're likely to see when you come down here. There's a great Mark Smith large round wreck here made of ceramics. One of our larger vibrant artworks and a great clock again by Matt Jardine, cabinet makers. Fantastic bit of wood. And here we have some of our splashback samples. Lots of pictures of previous commissions we've done. Again, these are all available on the website and in fact there's a lot more images on there for you to look at and to give you ideas. A few samples of the actual glass so you can kind of get a feel for the qualities of it. Some of our painted toughened glass samples for larger splashbacks. I'll just scan around and give you a general overview of the gallery from here. We've got some Stuart Ackroyd blownware in the middle of the studio at the moment, in the middle of the gallery. Some fantastic pieces that really need to be seen close up to appreciate the vibrant colours and the detailing of the work involved. show you a few side views of some of these pieces and a close up that it's tr quite tricky with some of this reflection. There's a few more pieces by Stuart Ackroyd here and the Karen Layton horse head. And some more Jackie Atkins vessels and ceramic. So I hope that's given you an idea of what we've currently got in stock at the moment. As always, if you've got any inquiries, um, just give us a ring and we're more than happy to help. And if you've seen anything on, the, on this little video that you like, uh, feel free to email us and we can always send you some close-up, detailed shots uh, of specific pieces that uh, you have your eye on. Uh, in the meantime, keep checking uh, for the website for new work and... Uh, keep updated by joining our Facebook page and we'll keep posting useful information and um, updates on any projects we may have ongoing at the time. Thank you very much.